G'day, you rotten lot. Welcome back to the channel. Thank you for tuning in today. We've got the Sonic Cake Metric Box 2. Uh, this, we've got the software up here. We're going to go through all the modulations today because uh, we're in full stereo and they sound uh, extra tasty. So, today, oh, I sound like this. And I'm trying out a few different things today. I've got the, um, where am I? Today I'm on the uh, Tweed Deluxe amp and I've got a Fender Bassman uh, 4x12 cabinet in just for something different. And I always use the church reverb but today I've also got a plate reverb on here just for something different. And I've got the dampening turned down a little bit as well. So here we go, I'm going to turn on the uh, modulation block and the first one is Chorus E. Lovely. Uh, now, like all the modulation effects, all the delays, everything in this uh, Metro Box 2 from Sonic Egg, you can sync everything to the, uh, where am I? The uh, BPM of each individual uh, preset, which is pretty cool. So I'm just going to bring the death back down, bring the rate back down. They go super fast. This, all of them have the same settings. D chorus is next. It's just got four modes on it, no knobs, just like the Boss uh, Digital Chorus. That was mode number two, mode number three. And mode number four, if I can click on it. I hate the uh, Apple trackpads on these laptops, I really do. Really, really lovely. Next one is the flanger. Gets up into self oscillating sort of territory. All right, next is the flanger N. This is a flanger with negative feedback. Yeah, it's sort of got a weird sort of out of phase sound, hasn't it, compared to the normal flanger? This next one's interesting. This is called the Trem Jet. This has got a tremolo and a flanger all in the one effect. if I turn the tremolo all the way up. Yeah, 
Yeah, that'd be really cool. All right, the bass jet. A classic flanging effect tuned for basses. Sorry, I'm playing the guitar. Next one, vibrato. Sounds like I lost a bit of volume there. I like my flanges really, uh, my uh, vibrato is really subtle. Copyright strike. Cool bucket brigade rotary. Now let's have a look here. Based on a bucket brigade, based on a bucket brigade based blue vibrato pedal. Oh. Sounds a little bit chorusy to me, but I think that's because we're in stereo. Phaser. I actually use phasers a lot. Where am I? Phaser. Uh, based on the legendary MXR M101 Phase 90. Pretty subtle, isn't it? All right. This next BBD phaser is based on the boss phaser. Get a bit more control over this one. Subtle phaser. ST, where am I? Based on Electro Harmonics Small Stone. That sounds more like a phaser. There's a warm mode or a sharp mode. There you go. That's what I use a phaser for. It gives that nice funky sound. Pan phaser, where am I? Pan phaser, a special subtle phaser combines tremolo and pan variations. <laughs> Oh yeah, I can hear it panning from side to side, that's awesome. Oh. 
Yeah, that's nice. All right, vibe. This one is based on the legendary Voodoo Lab micro vibe. Pretty cool, the uni vibe. Based on the classic Shin E uni vibe. I'm turning all these up so you can have a uh, good listen to them. Now this one has a chorus mode or a vibrato mode. Very nice. Tremolo will be so pretty self explanatory. It sounds like there's a stereo going from left to right as well. The sine trim, sine, trim low, waveforms and super wide tonal range. Okay, so this is a sine wave trim. The triangle, triangle uh, tremolo will be a triangle wave tremolo, which will be a bit sharper. Two left the bias trim, bias tremolo waveforms, bias tremolo waveforms, and super wide tonal range. Doesn't really tell me what's going on here. Oh, this is like a square wave. This one. Sweet, that's pretty self-explanatory, that one. D tune. Now, this is a slightly different sort of chorus. It's a much finer chorus. But it gives you the ability to mix in your wet and dry signal as much as you like, or as little as you like. Detune, the more detuned you get. So, a detune is pretty much just like a fully customizable, uh, you know, chorus, which is pretty cool. Uh, right, that is it. If you've got this far, thank you very much. Give us a thumbs up and a like, um, all that sort of stuff. There is a discount code for Sonic Cake products down in the description if you are keen on picking up one of these or uh, something from uh, Sonic Cake. So thank you for getting this far and spending some time with us. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.